Hi all, I want to show you how to insert a Super Nintendo emulator into your Xbox. You can use a blank DVD like this one, or you can use a storage device. And uh, you can use a normal USB stick like this one, or you can use a SD card like this. But uh, if you use the SD card, you will also need a SD to USB adapter like this one. And uh, in both cases, you will also need a Xbox to USB adapter cable like this one. And uh, that's pretty much it. Let's begin. Okay, start up your web browser and uh, go to this side and uh, just click the download button and save the file to your computer and uh, that's it just extract the folder into your desktop And if you want to use the blank DVD, just insert it and select image burn like this. And then now select write files and folders to a disk. And now select browse a folder and uh, that's this one. And the uh, just find your destination folder like this and select OK and that's it you just have to click on this logo and uh, it will burning a disk for you but uh, if you use the storage device you will just need to insert it and uh, don't format it, it will screw everything up for you and uh, now select explore 360 like this select drive open and select hard drive or memory card and select the partition 0 and now just drag and drop the folder into Explore 360 like this and uh, that's pretty much it it will not take that much time it's only 20 megabyte and uh, that's it just uh, take your burnt DVD or your storage device and insert it to, into your Xbox and uh, you are ready to go. Insert your blank DVD like this. Or insert your storage device like this. And power up the Xbox. And uh, the first thing you will need to do is select File Explore and if you use the blank DVD you will need to select the D drive and if you use the storage device you will need to select the L drive. And here you got a folder with all the ROMs and uh, the emulators and uh, now click the right bumper and select that drive you already have a uh, emulators folder and if you don't have the emulators folder just uh, select and drive you can use E, F and G and uh, if you don't have a upgraded hard drive you can only use the E drive but uh, if you don't have the emulators folder just click start and uh, make a new folder 
and uh, just uh, name it emulators and uh, that's it and uh, just select that folder and now click the right bumper and uh, select the start button and uh, just copy those files into your emulators folder and uh, confirm it I am the Shermanator a sophisticated sex robot sent back through time to change the future for one lucky lady I am lucky lady that's right Nadia you've been targeted for Shermanation come with me if you want to live <laughs> and uh, that's it just select ok and uh, go back and uh, now you just need to reboot your xbox and uh, now select the emulators folder and hallelujah you got a super nintendo emulator and uh, here you got some different choices you can save you can uh, make a screenshot you can use your screenshots you can make a uh, other controls for your gamepad and that's it, you can uh, also go back to your Xbox dashboard, but uh, select the game launcher if you want to play some at, your, some at your Super Nintendo ROMs. And uh, I just like Super Mario World, so I will select that. And uh, that sound is like being a kid again that's just make me happy and uh, as you can see it works pretty much the same way as a normal Super Nintendo you got uh, the same controls and uh, here's my body using now uh, let's go at some adventures Fuck. and uh, no legs at all it works pretty well and uh, that was how to insert a Xbox into a Super Nintendo into your Xbox. And uh, I hope you enjoy my movie. And uh, that was how to insert a Super Nintendo emulator into your Xbox. I hope you enjoy my movie and uh, don't be a snob. Remember to sub and have a nice day.